we're coming down off of this plateau. You missed a lot, you know, because this camera turned off all by itself. I didn't notice. The McCormick tractors.
they also said, what was the thing you said before that? Uh, oh, not driving on the same plane? Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. the leaders of our church never never fly oh, on the same plane. Oh, uh, yeah? I mean, you might get two of them on a plane, yeah. but you never get... Yeah, never get, you yep. never get the president and the two counselors on mm -hmm. the same plane. We're all, hey, that was a, a monarch. Oh, I didn't see it. Yep, yeah, they're getting south, souther and souther. They're making their way to Mexico. It'll probably take them till December to get there. Flutter buys. Now those look more like slash buys. If I, I don't know what a slash pine is, but I've heard of them. But those don't look like scotch pines. And well, then these over here look like um, juniper trees or cypress. Yeah, juniper cedars. Is that what ours, they call ours down Ours are the northern white cedars. Those ones have the little blue. These, yeah, these have the blue on them. Yeah. yeah. What are they called? Juniper or juniper cedar. Yeah. Because they are very like. Um, we have juniper cedar. bushes. Yeah. They have juniper trees. Mm -hmm. See, that field like that would be dotted with juniper yes. bushes. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. We're getting so well educated. Mm -hmm. Somebody wanted me to start making Nancy Today University t-shirts. Oh. <laughs> she wanted to buy one. She wanted because she felt like she had gotten an, a university education watching Nancy Today. But she had, you know, it was just for fun. Look, Beretta. A gun for sale. I have very strong feelings about being armed. I think that if you are armed, if a somebody comes and breaks into your house and he's got a gun, if you've got a gun, he's going to shoot you. Mm -hmm. So that he does, or he's going to get your gun. Either way, your risk of getting shot is a lot higher than if you don't have a gun. If you don't have a gun, you put your hands in the air. I don't know. I don't think you're going to get shot, but you might get shot. But if you've got a gun, you got to use it got to be ready to kill a person if you own a gun. So if somebody breaks into your house, if you don't kill him first, he's going to kill you. And, then and if he says, your money or your life, and you say, take my life, I'm saving my money for my old age. <laughs> <laughs> She's a hoot, isn't she? No, I think that I told my mother, if somebody, if she hears a lot of noise downstairs, do not get up and go investigate. Stay in bed. She's so little and frail, nobody would even realize that there's a person in the bed. Stay there and, you know, you might get robbed, but you'll be alive and nothing will be wrong with you. Yeah. They won't kill you if they don't know you exist. But if you have a gun and you show up with a gun, yeah. they know that you might shoot them, so they'll shoot you. That's my feelings on it. You're better off to be unarmed and hide. Of okay. course, that's a very Canadian uh, philosophy. Well, that more, more so than uh, an American philosophy. I think you'll find more Americans disagree with that and more Canadians agree with that. I think. It's because we're peaceful. Peaceful, peaceful, peaceful. That's where all the Vietnamese... Not Vietnamese. The Vietnam vet... No, the... People that didn't want to fight, they came to Canada. So we got a lot of them around. But we don't know who they are anymore. Now they're part of us. Now I'm part of us. Okay, bye. <laughs>